didn't know how to do it, but I knew that that's what I wanted to do. I don't know how I'm gonna get there, but I'm gonna spend my whole life, my whole life trying to figure it out. Seven pounds, nine ounces, your champion is Jacob Wheeler. Your 2012 Forest Wood Cup champion, Jacob Wheeler. He is the youngest BFL All-American champion ever. The youngest Sportsbook Cup champion in history. It, it means the world. It is the biggest thing that's ever happened in my life. He won the second stop at Table Rock. Wow! Unbelievable! Jacob Wheeler makes history! The run continues for Wheeler. Alright y'all, hey, just chowing down some Chipotle, one of my favorite spots. You know, today is our off day. Well, Group A is actually fishing today. We've got some work to do tomorrow. Looks like the weights are going to be, look a little bit low. Seems like a bite, the average bite's really like a solid fish, a two to a four pounder. Three to four pounds or whatever. But, I don't know. I want to see what happens. I'm excited to get out there and sort of see what them suckers Doink, doink, doink. We're gonna find out. All right. Sun's coming up. We have a little bit of a uh, later start. Should be a good day. I feel good about it. Slide up here in the Dunkin'. I don't think they have that that bagel, Brody. I'm sorry. I think they have turkey sauce. You might. That's the second best thing. It's all right. Yeah, all right. Let's see what we got. I'm at least need some coffee. I already got mine coming. Oh, coffee and a, and a, bagel. Ba a bagel. A bagel. A bagel. That's what I. They used to have this sandwich. Like, oh, they do still have it. No, no, no I don't think so. They had this like a Impossible sandwich. It's like, yeah. Oh, that was actually pretty good last week. That's time. On everything with a bagel. It's pretty solid. I'm gonna get a dang. Uh, oh, that's mine. <laughs> that's yours. You got your pre ordered. What's the goal weight for today, oh JoJo? Hold up, come here real quick here. What's the goal weight? Hold up, real quick here. Before I tell you guys, I've already pretty much lost 100 bucks. So we did it over and under. MBJ, Mark, and, uh, and DC are not here this week. We'll, we'll, we'll dive into this and I said I said 60 pounds I was the house I was the house this week yeah Lucas and Jordan picked I said 60 under. pounds picked under so yesterday it was under I mean we got a stout field today I you don't know I mean, I'm, I'm hoping I, I went a little I mean, high you're, you're, you're close because I think yesterday they probably didn't buy as good I mean I, bl I bluffed that when I thought, because Lucas, last time he told, he told me something at named Chickamauga, he said like some dumb amount of weight, and I'm like, he has no clue what a cut weight's ever going to be, so I actually you was like... You thought you had him. Oh, I thought I did, dude. He actually, he got me. You he to did. get that easy money. I was trying to get that easy money. I said, I, didn't, I wasn't going to take Jordan's money, because I knew he was going to be like, nah, buddy, nah, I, I ain't going for that, but I figured Lucas was like, yeah, dude, it's going to take at least that. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully we'll... All right, y'all. Morning. Here we are. Ready to go out here and try to catch a couple bass. I got large mouth. I got small mouth. I got. I got. A, I don't have a ton of both. But we're gonna go run around and fish the conditions, and that's what I love about this lake is you can just run around and fish. There's a lot of fish everywhere, but there's not. I mean, there's a lot of fish all scattered out, but not. I don't, I've not found that perfect group. So maybe we'll run in today. New day. We'll find out. Let's go.
All right, y'all, we are not quite started yet. I'm just looking at some places I didn't get a check, looking at the quality of the grass. Milfoil looks pretty snotted out, which means there's like algae in it. I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss something. Baby. Oh, a little small mouth. You gotta start somewhere, bro. Looking for your big brother, preferably a four pounder. Just go ahead and let you go like that. Thank you, sir. Okay, first bite. Not a big one, but he's a start. Not a big one. Whoa, boys. Hold on now, son. Whoa. We gotta... Here we go. Got us first one in the morning. Get the sucker locked in. Two pounds, 12 ounces. Okay. Quality, solid little Lake Champlain smallmouth. Let him go right back. Man, it's been a uh, little bit of grind. 18 minutes and I got a caught one dang come on now we gotta step our game up a little bit boys and girls but it's good to get the start of the, of the morning anyway i mean it's definitely good to get a little bit of a start just got to fish around a little bit the fish are scattered right now and so it's not like you can really sit on one place and bop 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 i fished around a lot and noticed that it's like i've never found i've not found a group of fish yet so there he is. Little small mouth. Just tell your dang dad to go bite, bite your my stuff. That's all I'm asking for. I'm not trying to be dang hard to deal with. I'm gonna let you go. Oh, god! There he is. Please don't come off, you big sucker. Don't jump, please, man. I hate jerk bait sometimes. Stay down. I, that was a little pot of them there. I hooked one, another one got it. It's up here pretty shallow. I still haven't seen the bait. Okay, don't do that. I think you're hooked pretty good. Come here. Please and thank you. Yeah, that's a solid one right there. Picked up a jerk bait, a little loco special. 13 fishing loco special. And got us that. First solid bite, man. We got a Try not to get hooked in your, actually got it good. See this guy, I'm not typically one to, sorry buddy. Four pounds, seven ounces. Ha <laughs> ha, that's a big biggie boys. Yes sir, absolute chunker. That's what we're after. All right baby, see you later. All right, we got to get back up here and sort of see what the heck's going down. Cause that sucker did not make it three jerks. Oh my goodness. There he is. Just gotta work around a little bit. Get that dang loco special to work. That's the thing, you can't really see them very well. They're scattered out. You almost gotta just move around and figure out what we're gonna do. I bet you it's another big one, dude. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Snap. Got him. I don't know, man. I can't, I hate it with these smallmouth. You can't see how the baits like large mouth, they body you jerk, jerk, and like let it sit there and it's like doinky. Small mouth, they're just, they're just so dang fiery and mean. They just nip at it. You don't know if it's got one hook or five hooks or you just don't know. It's a good one. I can't see the dang bait. Oh shoot, it's hooked barely. Yep, got you. See that right there is why you play them a little slower. See how that fish was hooked right there? Barely hooked. Last bass. Now he's wasn't coming off real easy, but let's try not to throw that. Let's try not get that jerk bait in the way. There you go. Three pounds, five ounces. Yep. Yep. That's what we're about. I'm trying to see if there's another group around. There was just a small group right there. I saw you, you sucker. I saw you. I saw you. Hooey. All right, buddy boy. 
Man, I just wish you suckers would just, just give up already. Just throw in the white towel. Problem is it's so hard to generate a bite that you definitely don't want to be pulling on them too hard. Got it pretty good, truthfully. Yeah, he's got it good. That's how you want him to get it, like that. Boom, just front hook, TKO it, lock up, fat, perch eating son of a gun. Beautiful fat fish though. That looks like, an, it looks like a St. Lawrence bass, I swear it does. <laughs> that sucker's like 14 inches long. He's probably like 17 inches long, but still. Three pounds, one ounce. Look how fat that sucker is. <laughs> He's like a day. Look at that. I got pretty big hands. And that sucker has got, he looks like a bluegill. Hold on, can I measure this fish real quick? He's a 16 and three quarter inch fish, a three pounder. That's crazy, man. That's a beautiful fish though. There was nobody. All right, settle on down, boys, settle on down. We all right. Jacob, get that fish. Moved you in the first place for 13 pounds, nine ounces. Come here, please. That one's not hooked yet, not just yanked on him. God, he made ice and egg with you, man. Two pounds, 10 ounces. Yep. All right. Kevin Van Dam is in third place. He's got 11 pounds, three ounces. This big bass is three pounds, 13. Come here, please. Ah, oh, you sucker. You might not even be a two pounder. Just grabbed you. Okay. There we go. Stop it. Two pounds, two ounces. There we go. Not the biggest one in the group, but definitely one. Perch. Yeah. I'm like, you sucker. Okay. Well, we found a little pod of them. Did, I'm not gonna say there's a lot of them here, but there's some here for sure. Ooh, there's one right there with him. Okay. Five, eight, seven, six, five, four, have to come with a game plan. I don't know exactly what we're gonna do yet. We're gonna re-rig a couple rods, get some stuff together, get ready to roll. There we go. Flip this one up. Ha ha! There is a bite. Two pounds, four ounces. There you go. Get us on this board in this second period. It's been a barn burner. Gee, many Christmas. Not a big one, but he's a scoreable. Oh, I think he's right there. I think he's right there. All right, let's get us another one. Two pounds, four ounces. There you go. Solid fish. Man, large mouth ain't playing no game, son. It ain't easy. It's not been that easy. Hopefully they decide to start biting a little bit. It'll be a little easier on us, man. That's all we're asking for. You got that sucker. Stop it, please, sir. I'll let you go right here in a second. Two pounds, one ounce. There he is. Thank you. Two pounds, 12 ounces. Yes, sir. Begging. Come on, buddy, we need you. Get your head up. Get your head up. 
Mm, thank you, sir. Take you. Oh, man. It has been an absolute grind today, but we got us another one. Stop it, buddy. Stop it. I'm going to let you go. Three pounds. Ten ounces. There you go. That's the kind you need right there to make it up quick. Golly, it's been a dang battle. These fish right here just ain't been my best friends. Let's be honest with y'all. They have not been on their best behavior. That's for dang sure. You know, good start to the morning and then it just been died after that. So let's hope we can get another one here. What's up? What's up? Ding 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 dong. <laughs> Thank you very much for a good day, sir. Hey, we'll get after We. Hey, I apologize, guys. I didn't get to update you a ton during the breaks. So I was rigging stuff up. I did have a couple. I had one I broke off and one I I. I got hung, hung up in a, in a little like some grass but that's just part of it really fish fairly clean other than just a just a handful of bites um man absolute grind out there on that pond though absolute grind we we freaking grinded hard but uh i don't know we're gonna have to go out there again I, I, we're sitting in the top 10 we're in 10th i think we're like 10 pounds up on the cut. 21 pounds is the cut right now. Oh, dude, I'm telling you, absolute grinder for your boy. Uh, that's oh, crazy. Yeah. It, it was freaking terrible out here, dude. Oh my gosh, it was horrible. Like, you couldn't even generate a bite. No, it's terrible, dude. Finished up, grabbing a quick bite to eat at B-Dubs. We are about to head back to the village. I don't know what we're gonna get into tonight. Probably just chill, relax, kick back, come with a game plan of how to catch a few more of those back. I might even mess with Lucas. He, if he wins this round, I'm not giving him his hundred bucks. <laughs> So I put the four pound line. I got, I got, I got my trusty helper here. They're trying right, to find out. These it. suckers will not bite. She got it. Oh, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good. I feel pretty good about it. Hey, four's not that bad. Are you gonna retie it now? No, heck no. <laughs> good enough. It took took a little bit four. And that's pretty. That ain't gonna break like that. Dude, but you gotta think too. You gotta think. You put small a mouth, small mouth, yeah, got the mouth, the teeth. Yeah, that's that's yeah. what does it. It's not, I guess, the pulling. It's those teeth. It's the teeth. Because you're gonna gut hook him on it too. And he's gonna go pop. Wrap him. No! Up. <laughs> Don't let him get around a rock. <laughs> it's ob. <laughs> that's like gonna be like, no, you're gonna be like so in string. Those little, those teeth. Shredded. This has been so tough. I've decided to just start throwing crappie line. So I, I, I've, I've stooped it down. Like you hook a bass and there's freaking 20 of them there and you can't get another bite. You're like, so if you whack them tomorrow, you better start digging for I'm four. Gonna, I'm gonna be coming over here, bringing it, sweeping out some hundreds for four pound. Four pound, four pound. I, I, I have caught a couple bass on four pound line in the tournament. A couple, that's it though, yeah, ever. It's, it's dangerous. It gets, it's a dangerous deal. Like you start to be like, when you hook them, your mindset is like, let me buy this drag off. <laughs> if DC was here, you give him some of that four pound. Oh, I'd be like, hey man, this is the deal. He'd be like, dude, he'd break them every single, he'd be yeah, like, hey. what? He's gut roping them. Oh, insane. He has to. Insanity. Come on, it's, we're talking about sizzle. He's gut roping them. We got to catch one for DC tomorrow. DC and Mark. No doubt. We got a real one in for him, boys. Right over here. We got a real one in for him. I don't know how you're surviving. 
They're not here. I know. I'm like, man, it's freaking sad. <laughs> I, had to go, I, got... I had to go hang out with you and I Lucas. Know, it's I brutal. To... It's like, dang, man. man you gotta go. To the... I stooped. I stooped so, so low. So low. You gotta go to the <laughs> F team. <laughs> not even the PD. Not A team. Freaking F team. The F team. Golly, man. That's crazy. So giving you guys an update on DC and Mark, we haven't really talked about it. DC and Mark are not here this week. Um, they both came down with COVID um, and actually went past their quarantine. Uh, DC went to the hospital. You can actually check out his post um, on social, on Instagram. And uh, Mark decided to opt out. He was just wanting to be safe and make sure. Um, he had some breathing issues as well. He wanted to make sure he was good to go. So. Um, better be safe than sorry. It's a thing. Um, it's definitely be safe out there, guys. It's not something. I mean, DC is a very, I would say, you know, in shape, pretty well, uh, young guy, and, and it really affected him. Uh, he was on oxygen for four or five days there in the hospital. So, uh, definitely something you got to be paying attention to. And I want people to know that. I'm sure you'll see some more on their channels um, as well going forward. So I'm not going to dive into all the details, um, but. We definitely wish them the best. I talk to them boys. I'm talking to them every day while I'm here, um, checking in on them. And uh, we got to catch a bass for them boys. We do. Fletch. Fletch as I well. I text Fletch uh, just a little bit ago see how he's doing. Yeah. And he's he's doing better. He's headed home. That's awesome. So, That's awesome. That's great to hear. I mean, it's I'm yeah, not that's sure a scary about the other deal, guys. But yeah, it is. When you get the dang, he says it was brutal. You know, the the league did a good job giving these guys an opportunity to drop a tournament <clears throat> this season um you know with all these guys i think there's eight guys out this week yeah um eight guys now one guy i, I think i don't know a couple of them i don't know exactly all their details or whatever but um i, I know a couple are not for sicknesses uh, you know, i think a couple guys are but um hey and we we got our work cut out for us and man it's crazy when you think about that there's <laughs> it is my hand it is crazy something that uh you don't you take take things for granted and in your health for granted sometimes yeah we all do yeah i mean you're what 29 yeah 29 years old and it's like man dc's 31 i know it's like um it's easy to take that stuff for granted it really is but we gotta get some bass tomorrow we gotta catch some tomorrow we gotta go reel some in we got a hey, just for them boys because dc would say they ain't gonna catch themselves they're not <laughs> no way in shape or form there's no way on this pot no <laughs> there ain't no way they're gonna catch themselves here hell you, you'd be lucky to catch them like no barely doubt. you got to work your butt off to get a bite a bite a bite, a bite. They, don't lose them do not <laughs> Hey, I start. I all. Please I, it's don't no go more St. Lawrence horsing them. There is none of that. Like no. it is straight. Please don't come yeah. off. Feeding them line. It's I feel be like another hour before I feel another tick. So. <laughs> Unless maybe it's a, it's a perch. Yeah, perch. I, I did catch quite a few perch yesterday. Yeah, I caught some little baby smallmouth perch. No bass. man, I'm sorry to be little smallmouth. I've caught several mm -hmm. bass. They just happen to be. About the size of my iPhone. Yeah. They were about that size. Yeah, they were about that size. Maybe a little smaller. <laughs> I caught one that was. I mean, they're they're about as small as bass can get. <laughs> I don't know the smallest. Bass. I mean, it's probably the smallest bass. I mean, he was probably that. It was a fingerling. <laughs> it was like that big. It spawned. It, it had to be from this year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like I'm on him. <laughs> he's he's he's, he's I up. felt like I was on him at that point. Well, you gotta feel good for the future of this lake with all the little ones in there. Yeah, Ready to go. get eaten by the pie. <laughs> <laughs> Run. <laughs> We got we got whooped. Just update, update, update. And they're about to get. They're about to get whooped in baseball too. 
singles. Oh no, I'm not even trying to get wood. I, it's, it's fine. I'm just I'm trying to build up people's confidence so that way. Uh, is that what you're doing? I can, I can win at horseshoes. That's why you. <laughs> <laughs> the horseshoe throw. <laughs> Golly. Mark's gonna blast him. I know that's not even fair. Yeah. That's probably a good idea. What, what? How do you even play? I don't even know how to play home run. How do you even play? You just set a boundary. Go there. So, run down. We're getting ready to play home run derby. I've never played home run derby. But, um, yeah, we're gonna see what it is. See what's up. I think I think we got Mark Rose. Look, he's getting, he's getting very serious. Look at him. Extension cords. We got all these things to play. We got all these things to play, and Luke wants to make up his own game. We got all these things. Luke's like, let's play home run derby. <laughs> Starts taking extension cords out, everything. He's very serious about this. <laughs> there. <laughs> Pitch me one. Way harder when you're pitching. You mean like go easy? Or yeah. Like, lob it up? Yeah. Like underhand? No, but just oh. overhand. <laughs> hey, buddy, I just. Okay, here we go. Ready? See how much harder it is? Ow! Get... I can't even hit. I've never played baseball in my life. Oh. Oh, yeah. You never played baseball? No, never in my life. What? No. Go get the tennis racket then. No, I'm good. I'm going to play. There you go. Good start. Uh-oh. Oh. Homer, dude. Hey. Dang. <laughs> oh. <It's> out. <laughs> Just tell me what you have. Yeah, money. That's money, dude. It ain't easy just to throw strikes, dude. Oh, I'm forcing it now. Right. Right. I'm trying to give you some good ones. I know. I need to go to the right. Sure. I'm in a practice pitch. Yeah, if you want. One practice swing. Throwing <laughs> 80. All in the pitcher. Homer. Oh, <laughs> that one pulled. Get out of that. Three of them. Get it, Wheeler. Get it, Yeah. Oh. I haven't hit a ball in many years. I think I was a heater. He just now got warmed up. Huh. That's right, that's fair. That fire mark. Man, you're the oldest. Well, you, just, you just now got warmed up. That's the first ball I've hit in a long time. Oh. See what I mean? There it is. Oh, boy. It's out here. Hey, Wheeler! <laughs> it's in. It's, it's in anyway. <laughs> that's why I don't care. Put them by like that. <laughs> I want to get every yeah, ball. Yeah, somebody got to go up the pitch. Mark, Mark did a good job. Yeah, give me a couple. I need a couple warm ups myself. Oh! A little low. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, oh, man. <laughs> he said, now we start. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Gone. Gone. Oh. <laughs> he still went and got it. That was, that was gonna hit him. Foul ball. No. Foul ball. That was. Foul. <laughs> cool. Oh, that was high. Yeah. That was it, and I missed it. Two. Joe, how many do you have? Three. Dang. Oh, Rob. 
That was dirty, Joe. That was... Dude, he's connecting with everything. One out, one home run. Are we doing a... It, we're starting a new one. Is a strike and out, or are we going to let those pass? You got to make contact. Come on. Now just do whatever you want to do. I, <laughs> I mean, you can throw as far, throw as far, it doesn't matter, hard as you can. Oh, that was catching them. Littner. <laughs> These guys haven't called them that great. Lambert and Spoyer. It's going to be 50 pounds. It's, no, it's, you know, it's not going to be 50 pounds. It's going to be like 55. I should, if 55 would have been the perfect bet. It's going to be like 50. You want to bet? I'll bet you another bet. No, I don't want to bet. I'll bet you $100. No. It's going to be above 56. Above 56? Above 56. 100 bucks. Where's Lucas at? No. I'm trying to give that 100. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. Above 56, I'll no, take above it. 55. Above no, 56. no, no, no. 55. Above 55. Above 55. Above 55. Above 55. Above 55. You got, dude, you got an hour and a, there's no way. I ain't taking that bet. 55. I ain't taking that bet. I'll do 56. 55, bro. No. <laughs> I'm getting away from you for all this more money. <laughs> but I did win 100 bucks from you. But I bet it on you, so that was worth it. That's yeah, the only money you've won from me ever. Gosh, dang, I've donated plenty to JoJo. How did, the, how did the home run derby go? So, home run derby, give you guys a, a breakdown. We had a good time. Um, who won the whole thing? Joe, you win, Jordan? No, yeah. Mark won. Right here. Mark Rose. It's actually, you guys, don't, don't miss it up. It's not Mark Rose, it's Mark McGuire. Just letting y'all know. Sammy Sosa, whatever you want to call him. He's uh, the home run champion. Heavy hitter. Is, is... He said Jordan said he's going to give him a pack of flat worms for, for winning. <laughs> oh, that was a good time. They're going to catch 10 pounds that last freaking hour. For sure, I need my money back. Get out of here. Hey, you don't want Never said a weather delay. Man, I've all noticed that that's always how we play with Mark in DC. Oh, bull, dude. Man, I, 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 I literally ran this. It's through YouTube, man. Everybody knows on the channel, literally knows this is so part of the rules. So Tell it. they know you're coming back and asking for your money. No, I'm just saying that the rules are if there's a weather delay, that jacks up the deal. Oh, my and there's God. There's a swash. It's just how it is. Jordan, <laughs> did you hear that? It's a cutway. That's how it's always been played. But it's okay. I'll, I'll make a technicality for you guys. Because I like you a lot. <laughs> I don't my, my, man, my man is asking for his money back. I, don't, I just said, I, I'm just, he I'm lost just, in tennis, guys, he literally. Lost in home run derby and he lost in the cut weight bet and now he wants his money back. It's okay. It's okay. Do you want do No, no, I just said it was split. Do we need to go play tennis again and, and throw some more balls to you again? Some horses. Uh, we, we can play uh, tennis. I, I, we'll, 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 go play, we'll go play tennis. I'll play one on one. hundred bucks. We're we're gamers, hey, singles, a hundred bucks right now. Cornell? Singles. Oh, I see this He's all competitive advantage. Competitive advantage. It's like you're He don't want to play tennis though. Dude, all you're doing is throwing a bag with corn in it. It's easy. Come on. I've only played a couple times. I've played this sucker a lot. <laughs> sucker gets fired up too. Yeah. Me and just me and Justin Martin played Lucas and his bus buddy at ICAST a few years back. And we ain't playing again, <laughs> not like that. Uh, uh -uh. Yeah. What's that? Oh, we get you off the water, you know, and now you can get beat in some things and you don't like it, so <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> You're all the tournament flat. <laughs> Slide in here. The OG right here. Mark Day. Dang OG. Hey man. Oh god, Mark, you feel like suckers in, dude. Huh? You feel like suckers in. You're doing a good job. So Mark's been in the game for years, years. Probably top. I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you. Mark Mark's won a lot. He's done really well in a lot of tournaments. Top top five all the time. Right there. Top five. Top, my personal top five. That's it. That's it? Alright, there you go. Five. Six. Please, I can do it.
Lou Dines was sore for pushing him off that sandbar. He would have made it, but there was a kayak in his way, and he tried to go around him instead of. He couldn't let out of it. If he let out of it, he's he's done. And so he tried, it was a kayak in his way. It was kayak in his path, so he, so he could have made it. Yeah, he would have made it, but he tried to go. Took a left and tried to go around him, and it was his teeth. <laughs> he made a long way around sticks, and I said, start laying them underneath the front of the boat. And we'd push it up on Air one. Roll. And no, it slide. It wouldn't roll because the sand was. Oh, too, it's it sliding. It in. Yeah, it's sand. But it slide on them sticks. It would slide on the sand. We'd uh, stick up. Yeah, they played on baseball when they were kids or something, yeah. man. They got us good. <laughs> Dude, I forgot. I forgot. I'll, I'll do a raid that truck. I forgot. I need my little orange wacky bird. I forgot. Damn. Uh, and he's messing around. I know. I got one hole on Lake Champlain that they will eat nothing but a four inch wacky worm. Gosh, I might have that. I don't know. They're just big. I don't want no stupid color either. Give me like green pumpkin. Dude, <laughs> <laughs> I give you every damn color I got if I. Uh oh. Oh, is that green pumpkin watermelon? I, I don't know. Oh my gosh. All right. Thanks, boy. Is that it? I just got me a check. <laughs> uh, is that it? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Later. Sure. Hey, Livy! How are you? Good morning. All right, y'all. So one thing I always do, start, I get up here before takeoff, turn my motor, troll motor on, make sure, go through that progression of like, okay, hey, the troll motor works, that's good, check. Make sure your electronics work, make sure everything looks right. And uh, that's all you really need to do, just making sure you do your checklist because the pro worst thing that could happen is you get to your first place and then not have your equipment. So, you know, and then I got all my rods sort of put up here, a couple different things. I might put up a couple more dot rods, but we should be good to go. I might put this sucker back here. Uh oh, look at Brody. Bringing the thing, man. All right, little Marshall, look. This is the deal. Since Mark and DC are not here, I got to bring you in the boat for good luck. You are our camera guy of the day. You sit right there. We'll make sure you're safe. You get a pretty good little location. So that's the deal. A little Marshall in here. Man, the guys, we got to catch some bash from Mark and DC. Both Adrian and I are in this group right here. Adrian's just inside or just outside the cut. He's going to go do the thing he loves to do, man. He's, uh, and then I'm just going to go out here and try to reel a few bass in myself. Uh, weights were really went up yesterday, which this group right here, I would assume they're going to go up again today. Uh, we got some work to do, though. We got some, some some decisions to make and see if we can't make the right ones and come out of here. Um, maybe not make sure we're making the knockout round, and maybe you never know. Like, if you have a good enough morning, uh, slide up there and try to, try to get after it and try to win. Good morning. People are just hopping on. People are just hopping on. Day number two. What's up? What's up, everybody? Uh, group B, and look who I have with me. A little, a little Marshall. A little Marshall. Catch him a couple, man. I got to go catch those boys a few fish. So we're just idling out right now. I wanted to holler at y'all. All right, little Marshall. They're freaking it's getting so hot. They gotta be getting out. They gotta be, dude. 
Let's try. Gosh dang it, you sucker. Two pounds, one ounce. Yes, sir. Stop it, please. Golly, man. That's a better one. Don't come, just get up here. There you go. Got you. Got you. Two pounds, 13 ounces. Yes, sir. All right, we got a 213. I don't think so. Nope. It's a pound and a half. -er. I'm gonna take my time with this one. It's a big one. Don't jump, you sucker. Come on, man. He's mean. Oh, you sucker, come here. Gotcha. Oh, I hooked him in the tongue, too. All right, we'll get him on hooked. And... There you go, buddy. Three pounds, 15 ounces. There you go. Beautiful fish. Golly. Sucker was not playing around. Golly, he's not coming off. He was not coming off at all. Two pounds, three ounces. Two, three. Not a giant one, but we're just getting, we just gotta get up there above that cut line. We just gotta be up there and stay up there for a little while. We're just gonna have to get our stuff together. Holy smokes, man. Gotcha, bub. Three pounds, zero ounces. Yes, sir. That one blew up. Large now. Well, okay then, Mr. Large Mouth. Two pounds, zero ounces. Two pounds, seven ounces. Yes, sir. Come on, man. I had your head up and everything. All right, we're coming after him now. Two pounds, five ounces. Two. There you go. Two pounds, seven ounces. I said, okay. Yeah, I was like, man, I. Look bigger than that. How'd you get one? Big one. Oh, large now. It's not a big one. I thought it was a big, small now. Two pounds, one ounce. Sir. 
characters. We're about to win. So we're about to win. Three pounds, two ounces. Yes, sir. We're about to win. We are about to win. I'm pretty sure. I think for sure, for sure. I'm just saying, I'm pretty sure. Big one. Ah, that's a big sucker right there. I mean, a freaking big one, dude. That one right there, son, is a um, ding ding baby. Absolute giant. Keep on that. 13 ounces. 13. Here, give me a, uh, give me a flare over here. Dude, come on, bro. Three pounds, five ounces. Yes, sir. Okay. Can I lay him down real quick here to grab this hook out? Three pounds, seven ounces. Two pounds, 14 ounces. Two pounds, 14 ounces. Eight ounces. Yes, sir. Two pounds, eight ounces. Yep. No, you sucker. Dang. I don't think he's big enough. Them things are crazy. Right? Oh, he come off. Okay, I ain't freaking doing any more of them. Perch. Golly. There we go. Like the problem is I don't even know if I can fish that stuff. Like it's gonna be so bad. You know? So that's why I was trying to freaking make it work. And I'm like, yeah. Your boy's gonna be out there in the freaking waves tomorrow, son. I'm talking straight. Waves. Not give two flips about it. And let's go. <laughs> huh? Gosh, man. Whew. Little Marshall, man. Good luck. Little Marshall brought us some good luck. I said you better hold on. Batten down the hatches for the, for the, your boy tomorrow. Golly. Good golly, Miss Molly. Hey, that's right now they see your trailer. That's why I saw that. Okay. Yeah, I saw that. You said something, I didn't. 